I'm Sean, and this is my podcast. I don't know what I'm calling it yet. I I, I threw out some other names. Um, but it doesn't matter what it's called, right? So, I'm also thinking about setting this up with my little brother, possibly. Uh, I know he wants to do one, kind of set things up for himself. So maybe a little bit of cal uh calibration collaboration um but my previous scheme was like telling stories but i also like to just be able to talk but it you you get to a point where you're like oh what are you going to talk about but um yeah I also want to do a game stream. So we've been playing, like, when I'm off of school, we've been playing games. So we could really be streaming that, just putting out, you know, content for whatever it is. I'm just interested in talking, right? Because if you process emotions and thoughts, you know, yourself for other people whatever it may be it gets you to a deeper level I think or a higher level whichever way you want to look at it this is my mask out of the show I got one of these at work too I found it my mask out at work uh, but yeah man I'm gonna say big things are coming, but things are coming. Life, life's coming. Things keep going good. I guess I should quit doing that in the chair. Um, life's gonna keep going, and I'm excited about the future for sure. Things have steadily progressed uh, more and more positively as better decisions are made and you know the right steps are taken to uh you know go further hmm this one's kind of weird i had a scheme before i was you know it's like oh let me tell you a story i can't even think of a story i mean i have plenty of stories but i don't remember the stories that i told either I'll tell you one thing, I'm so big about giving out praise to those who deserve praise for influence, you know? Like, I, I, I like to provide praise to others, like, yo, you don't, you don't know how much your influence, you know, helped me, but, uh. I just recently had a situation where somebody, somebody close, you know, made mention of like, oh, you don't, you don't realize. Actually, I had two instances, one, one further away and one kind of just happened. But, uh, but people just like, yo, you don't understand the influence that you had on me at one time, you know, and, and really like you do know it. That's what you do it for, right? Like you want to be a good influence just in general not like by actions or whatever i mean i guess by actions but I'm, I'm i'm saying like you want to provide goodness for somebody and you appreciate the goodness in return but that it shouldn't be done for that right so obviously you can't let people fuck you over and then still bring positive light to their life. That's a hard cycle. It's difficult. Uh, but yeah, man. I'm excited. I think I think the game thing would be cool. Cause 
we kind of flow more freely on the game and it it like bridges the gap where you where you have things that you're focused on you could see us playing the game while also hearing us bullshit and talk this is fine too it's hard to think about what are you going to talk about like do you talk about relevant shit going on in your life do you talk about relevant shit going on in the world like what's going on in the world see nobody wants to hear uh, like nobody wants to hear about that shit and if they do they want to go like they, they have other places to go you know like you don't listen to my dumbass about fucking whatever I don't I don't participate in it so then at that point it's like alright well bring light to what you're interested in I'm interested in people kind of how they work and why I work the way I work and why things happen which is cool it's like a broad subject but it's so it's difficult right cause then you sound like you're just fucking going on and on about the same weird meta bullshit like Oh, listen to me try to sound smart. I dig deep within myself and find layers upon layers. I don't know. I'm just a weird motherfucker, man. Just weird. Just trying to figure shit out, that's all. I think that's what this is going to be. I think I, I, already, I already came out with some stories. I'm going to do stories, too. I might keep that shit separate. Maybe I'll, st maybe I'll backlog the stories. And then maybe I'll throw the stories on an actual podcast, so it'll be part of it, you know. I'm sure if me and my little brother get together, we'll uh, we'll be talking shit and throwing stories in there and whatever. So, but I have, should I? I probably have I don't know ten or so already recorded it's like five minute segments this is probably the longest one I've done this is just kind of riffing I'm just kind of talking about what I what I expect to come from the future in regards to this and in regards to whatever I also want to get on stage so bad and I'm hoping if I can get over the fear of doing this which I'm not like, like fearful of it but it's like it's it's weird right it's like you when you look at it, you go, it's it's almost ego driven because you're like, oh, you assume somebody might want to listen to what you have to say. But it doesn't have to be that, right? I'm just doing this for my own progress. And then if that leads to some progress for somebody else, that doesn't have to be a problem, you know? Um, I need a fucking haircut. Look at my hair, man. Ugh. But, yeah. I want to get on stage. I'm wondering if they're going to open up the club here. If I should start trying to look. I guess at the point that I'm even, like, questioning that. I've only done it twice. So I was still nervous. I'm still nervous. I'm still nervous. So then the excuse that my club right next to me isn't open is the excuse I can run with. Oh, look, I can't do it. But I should be. I have so much shit going on, though. But it's like, get over it, bitch. Do it, you know? If that's what you want to do. There's so, you know, there's so much. So much time in the day that is wasted, could be wasted, or it could be utilized, you know? And you can manage if you know you have shit coming up, you have stuff to do, you can manage it. You can say, okay, well, look, hey, I got vacation days. Let me take half a day off so I can plan to do something that I want to do, you know? It could fit into the schedule, that's all I'm saying. <laughs> Excuse me, but I'm not going to act like I'm not going to do that regularly. I burp a lot. Well, t 
10 minutes wow that's a good one see i feel com like this is where i need to learn on stage i feel comfortable right now just kind of pausing especially because at the moment i'm not this isn't even going out or nothing and it might it might not who knows but i feel comfortable pausing i'm like okay whatever let me collect my thoughts but i don't do that on stage and I think you, you have that allowed time. If you have precision with it, you can make it work, you know? I'm wondering, I'm wondering if I should do this audio or video. I'm not sure. I'm also wondering how easy it is to take the audio from video I guess there's no reason not to just put it out as a video, you know, but I guess certain, yeah, certain platforms don't allow video, right, so, hmm, it's interesting, I'm trying to think of a story, I'm sure I have a story or two okay now I'm not comfortable with the silence it was too long <coughs> um, fuck a story a story a story what kind of story oh I went to I went to school for work. It's a bullshit story, but it's a, you know, it is what it is. I went to school for work and I'm staying on Orlando. And I come down in the morning. It was this it was either there for a day or this was on the second day cuz I was coming home that day, so it wasn't that big of a deal. Um I come out in the morning and the window's broken in the car the rental car that my work gave me to take up there and uh so the, the uh, not only mine I, I like i don't want to exaggerate but just say multiple cars in the parking lot also got broke so m where i fucked up i had a backpack but the backpack didn't have anything in it i left the backpack in the back seat because it didn't have anything in it and i wasn't worried about it well they only broke into places, uh, places. They only break it, broke into cars that had shit in it where they were like, oh, you know, something's there. The other crazy thing, the fucking door was unlocked because there was nothing in the car. They could have just opened the door. Um, so the cops show up and they're like, yeah, like this place, this hotel was known for having broken windows in cars like this specific spot they're like yeah man you shouldn't stay here it was kind of wild then my work almost wanted me to pay for it it's like yo what like i specifically don't go outside of the area of what i'm allowed to do so i don't have any issues it was kind of crazy that was a bullshit story I have better stories. I told some other stories. I'll have to go back and review. See if I want to do what I did with this one. Just kind of roll into it. Talk about some shit. Then maybe bring something up or whatever. I couldn't think of a story this whole time. I still can't think of I have ten. St uh, maybe that's why I'm blocking them out. Because I know I already told them. But. uh Alright well. I'm out.